I don't think I there's it. anything like that. There hasn't been anything like it on the telly. It's such a great idea, oh, and it was you. really the first series, which was what January. Yeah, really it was well received. A while ago, now it was really well received. I had no idea how it was going to go down because, if we're honest. It's a little bit crazy. You kind of take two people who've never met and get them to dance together. And I was like, how are people going to take this? But people kind of get emotionally affected by it. When yeah. they turn around and they see these people see each other and dance, it has a real... It's got something about it that's magic. Well, you know I love it, because I yeah. kept saying to you, because we were doing Dancing on Ice, I and I was like, I watched it this week, this happened. <laughs> wanted to know all the information. Um, I mean, Strictly kind of call, call it a curse. They do. This is... You've turned this into a blessing, because curse people reverse, do yeah. fall in love when they're <laughs> dancing. Why is that? What happens? I, do you know what? I, w I wish I understood exactly why, but there is something about looking at each other. There's an honesty about it, right? Yeah. These people look at each there's no to hire, they can't use words. But watching the, the, the stuff there, yeah. uh, it's quite obvious. There are some really quite spectacular lifts. Yeah. Um, there are, these are complicated routines. <clears throat> so you are, as you explained, you have mm -hmm. separated them. They never meet. Never the meet. first time they meet is yeah. when, they, when they're about to dance, that exactly. moment they dance together. Yeah. So if there is a big lift, mm -hmm. then you have to, you've got to have taught one person how to dance, do the lift and the other person how to be caught. So there was one couple. Right, they both had like trust issues, and I was like, Look, you, you, you need to get over they this. They had trust they issues. They had trust issues. They hadn't, <laughs> they hadn't even met. So, what I did was this I said, Right, the first thing we're going to do is you're going to walk up to this person, you're going to lift, drop, and catch them before they hit the floor. They haven't even looked at each other yet. So, that I was like, You have to, I'm going to throw you in at the deep. And they end. just do that. And well, they, they trust me after a, a little bit of persuasion, and then they do it. And then when they turn around, they've already had this like amazing moment together yeah. and they haven't even looked at each other. It's a so it's a real, it's an icebreaker. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and it, I mean, it doesn't always work. I mean, you no. sort of, you watch on with either great pride or mm. huge guilt, I imagine. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, this is one of those things, if it works, it's spectacular and if it doesn't, it's also spectacular, awkward. just in the room. <laughs> just in, it is a little bit awkward turtle like that. We had one, there's one this series in particular, and it doesn't go well. They they don't get along really. What, they How don't can they not dance get on? well, or what? They what dance it? well because they they rehearse within an inch of their lives. Yeah. But it's not about the moves. It's about how they do the moves. And if somebody doesn't really want to be there, it is all over their face. So within within all what is the dance? Oh. Two, three, four minutes. They've decided. Yeah that they don't like them to that degree uh, in three absolutely. or four Absolutely. You know, you know how it feels. If you're, if you're that close to somebody, and it does not that you don't like them, but if it doesn't feel right, you know. And then I'm asking you to jump, lift, catch, throw, get close, and it, it can just be, it can be awkward. And um, for Stand Up To Cancer, you're doing yeah. a celebrity one. We are. I'm. I'm so excited. Have you done it? Or yeah. Yeah. It... So we've done it. Oh, you've done it. You know what's exciting, right? Is that normally two people turn around who've never seen each other. Now, if you add into that the fact that it's a celeb and a non-celeb, <laughs> someone turns around and, and goes, "Oh my God!" I know you. I know you. So it, one's a celeb, one's not. One's celeb. not exactly. So but it, they're not looking mm. for love. Yeah. They are looking for yeah, love. It's a celeb that's looking for love. There's well. many for layers love. Yeah, of this. This is all about love. Faceted. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Um, Dancing Ice back again. I yeah. mean, you are very, very busy. Uh, you, yeah. you were within your 50, uh, 50 show tour, show tour yeah, with minute. diversity at yeah. the moment. What did you do? Four shows in two days last yeah, week? Yeah, literally. It's outrageous. Like in it? an ice bath, yeah. and you're all broken. <laughs> Just breaking all of them, yeah. Ten years on, if we can't get past it now, then we need to uh, we need to stop. But I'm not letting it happen. So when you uh, when you see Dancing on Ice on, uh, uh, coming up on mm -hmm. the horizon, is that like a oh okay? Do you know what Dancing on Ice is? It's actually one of those things that I look at and go, that's going to be a nice, fun, relaxing thing to do because normally we're on stage for two hours and it is just like hardcore. I mean, I absolutely adore it, but. Genuinely, that's one of the reasons I love the OI, because I can look at the celebs yeah. and the partners doing the hard work and I can sit there. Mm. There is one member of diversity who will not be <laughs> oh, yeah, that way <laughs> Oh, my God. Out. He spoke to Perry about it. Do you know what? So, right, here you go, a bit of inside information. He, um, he nearly broke his toe. Oh, a few don't weeks you back. break Perry? We I need know. him. And so he's been, he's been strapped up, he's been going to training, coming back on a train, doing the show. He's saying to me, Ash, I, I need to be as good as I can be. And he feels all of this pressure, right? People going, oh, you're going to be great. It will be yeah. easy for you. Yeah, yeah. And it's not. Is so... it going to be weird for you judging him? Uh, no, I think it will be easier for me judging him. I, I mean, 
I, I judge him every day. Literally, I kind of yeah, have to look at him enough. and say, Pell, do that better, or Pell, that's... I, I do it all the time. So yeah. it'll be harder for me, I think, to judge other people. With Pell, it's like... it's Because the thing is with do. him, he just won't stop. I mean, he just no. wants to be the best at it. He wants to be the best, and he also wants to do things that have never been done on the ice before. He's not going to start flipping about, is he? I'm not, say I'm not saying too much, but... Wow. He really... Oh, I'm not sure I can cope. Oh, please don't break him. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't got to tell me. To tell him when you're doing this. <laughs> what about John Barrowman? Oh, what, what a ledge. I mean, literally, like, we had our first filming day a little while back mm. and I was thinking, oh, my gosh, you know, it's changed and how's it going to be? I mean, I could spend days with him. He's, he's a funny guy. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's got so much energy and he just does everything. He's like actor, singer, dancer, skater. Like, so I'm like, right, I'm excited to see what he brings. Because you've well. already done a bit of filming, have you? Yeah, you yeah, guys, yeah, so that all stuff. the judges have got together. Yeah, so that it yeah, must yeah. change the dynamic slightly between you all. The, the dynamic is different. Yeah. In, a, in a brilliant way. Like, we okay. just had so much fun on the day. And I'd I just talk to myself, no, I can see this working. It's going to be brilliant. Good, He's good, good, good. Great and addition. we've got the Christmas shows. We're bringing back some ex-winners. I know. Who yeah. are all coming back. So. Jake Quickenden on the ice. Got Ray uh, Quinn. Ray People Quinn keep saying, the oh, the Jake judges Chris. need to get on the ice and do some stuff. Well, you, so, can you can skate, skate though. Yeah, I can skate, yeah. Well, when I was younger, I used to, it was skating and dancing for me. Genuinely. Well, that means now the whole panel can skate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, are you going to skate? Um, do you know what? If I skate, I'm one of these people, right? Some people call it perfectionist. You know? So I'm like, if I want to get on, I need a good few weeks to prep. But absolutely, if well, I get the chance... you've got a good few weeks. What are you doing? You've been doing 50 <laughs> tours <laughs> yeah. days. If Perry yeah. can do it, you could do exactly. it. Lead by yeah, example. Yeah. Ex absolutely, yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you very much indeed. Yeah. Um, at the Flirty Dancing, uh, just amazing. Friday at 8 on Channel 4. Uh, and thank you very thank much. Thank you, guys. See you thank at you. Christmas. See Starts you then. Nice.